connection to the old conference thing? It's a nice accomplishment. I don't. <laughs> it's nice. I heard that uh, Kelsey Newman and Jenna were were on it. Just Jenna. Oh, Jenna. Just Jenna. Sorry. And um, yeah, it's a nice accomplishment. In tournament play, obviously now things are the stakes are much higher. Mm -hmm. uh, let's talk about um, just the approach now moving in, knowing it's it's winter go home. Yeah. Um, we have, we need to have a really good week of practice. We need to come out and we have to work. Um, we have to be very focused on on the job that we need to get done. And um, I think I think winning on Saturday, I think that was good for us. I think um, we got back to you know doing the little things. And so I think um, going into Wednesday's game, like no team is gonna just lay down and give us the game. So I think that you know it is go win or go home. And so we have to come out and we have to. Um, play as a team and do the little things um, like we we have all season. It's been a little bit of a roller coaster, mm -hmm. a lot of success and then some down times. But uh, what do you guys need to do to make sure that you're as well prepared as you need to be to have the success that you want in postseason play? Um, I think each one of us have to be ready to play. Um, I think that we have to we have to be ready to just come out and and to work extremely hard and to do the little things, focus on the little things, and not not so much focus. We we need to be prepared on what you know, Oakland's going to do, but we have to be prepared on what we're going to do and um, focus on what we can control. How motivated is this group right now to really do some special things? I, I think we're really motivated. Um, we, we have been up and down this year, but we know that we were successful last year, and I think that we're, we all want to be just as successful as we were last year. Can you just talk about Oakland a little bit? I mean, mm -hmm. you beat them here by 15, they beat you by 20 on their home floor. I mean, two different games, two contrasting different mm -hmm. games. Um, Oakland's good, and I, they they play extremely hard. Um, they have they have some good guards. They have some good posts. Um, I think that they it's kind of it's different because the first game it, like the games were completely different. So I'm not I don't know. Coach Barnes is probably going to know more about kind of what they're going to do um, than me. But all I know is that we can. We can focus on what they what they're gonna do, but really we just need to focus on what we can control, and that's us. How about it seems like if you guys are hitting three pointers, you're you can beat anybody, and if mm -hmm. you're not, you know, you struggle. Is that maybe one of the biggest factors? In a game like this? Yeah, um, I think when when we're not hitting three pointers, we we really have to buckle down on defense, and then and we need to get the ball inside more. Um, Obviously, when you're making shots, you're more confident. But I think when we're not making shots, we have to focus more on defense. In the league, those defensive numbers got higher. Mm -hmm. Shooting percentage, the points allowed. Is there a way to kind of, whether you're making threes or not, to ratchet it back up to where you were a little earlier in the year? Yeah, I think um, throughout the throughout the league play, we kind of lost focus on defense. And I think that that's, that's really going to be a key this week. Um, at, at practice and on the game on Wednesday. Is there any motivation since Oakland kind of ended the men's season, or is it? I mean, do you guys even pay attention to that? Yeah, we do, and I think I think that gives us motivation, and then obviously um, the loss at Oakland gives us more motivation too.